an actress once. And a pretty decent one at that. I made hundreds of movies that no one remembers. <laughs> I hate Hollywood. I hate it the way I hate a snoring husband or a best friend who steals your snoring husband. I hate how I crave Hollywood's approval. I hate begging for work as much as I hated the work I was getting. At some point, I decided I had had enough. But I love Hollywood. I love it the way I love a good bad guy, the way I love a mean femme fatale. Oh, I love how it's fake when it's trying to be real. I love how it cuts, how it abandons, how it sparkles, even when it's burning itself out. In Hollywood, gratitude is public enemy number one. I could never have left it completely. It's a love-hate thing. Like the press. If they don't love you, you don't get mentioned. If you don't get mentioned, you don't get to work. And if you're not working, what is there? <laughs> Hollywood is a company town. We're all here to work. They erect people, they crush people, and they get rich doing it. When a man does that, he's powerful. When a woman does that, she's a bitch. <laughs> when I was offered my first column, I jumped at the chance. I had access to the actors. I was one of them. And it wasn't long before Hollywood had another vibe to hang its gossip on. Hedda Hopper. I know the gossip. I know who and where and what they were wearing and who they were cheating on. You see, the power comes not in the telling, but in knowing what not to tell. And when it comes to gossip, no one supplies more to my column than the reigning queen of MGM, Joan Crawford. <laughs> and the leading actress and Warner Brothers, Betty Davis. Me, but more importantly, the things they tell me not to tell. Kirk Douglas, Barry Norman, John Wayne. There's a phrase they like to throw around when they're casting the powerful female lead. Bitch virtuosity. It's a skill you're gonna need if you're a woman in Hollywood. Douglas Fairbanks Jr., Peter Shaw, Jackie Gleason. Either that or get ready to spread it for every <laughs> casting agent in town. <laughs> Charles Martin, Tyrone Power, Johnny Weisswheeler, John Pierre Omar, Jackie Gleason, Ben Heflin. You win an Oscar by playing the bitch. Robert Serling, James Craig, Robert Preston, Kerry Grant, Clark Gable, Franchot Tone, Joseph L. Mankiewicz, Spencer Tracy, Ian <coughs> Brenner, Rock Hudson, Barbara Stanwyck. <laughs> <laughs> I fucked them all. <laughs> well, except for Rock Hudson, but I still did him. I was speaking! And I never mind if the casting <laughs> helped drive him. It sure as hell beats the cold hard floor. Right. She slept with every male star at MGM, except Lassie. 